Happy Sunday, everyone. Hope you enjoyed that extra hour of sleep from last night from Daylight Savings. Go ahead and take a good look behind me. Here's the pinpoint forecast. You can see we're looking forward to a pretty nice work week ahead of us. Just some cloud cover, but other than that, looks pretty fair and calm. As you can see behind me, we've just got some cloud cover as well as just these little green spots right off the coast, giving us just a slight chance for some showers on some days. But here's the forecast for tonight, starting with the coast. For tonight, we're looking at mostly cloudy skies, some areas of fog. We'll see those areas of fog tomorrow morning morning as well. Partly cloudy skies to go along with it. We're going to have winds coming in at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Overall, we're looking at highs in the 60s, mid 60s overall, 65 for North Bend, 64 Brookings looks like 63 for Crescent City for tomorrow. Heading over to the West Valleys for tonight, mostly cloudy skies. We've got a slight chance for some showers and fog after midnight. And for tomorrow, we'll see that fog in the morning as well with sunny skies throughout the day. Highs overall, we're looking at low to mid 60s, 65 for Medford and Grants Pass, 60 Mount Shasta City, 62 Wairika. We're looking at 65 degrees for the high tomorrow in Roseburg. East of the Cascades for tonight, mostly cloudy skies. We're looking at a slight chance for some rain showers tonight. Otherwise, for tomorrow, we're looking at morning fog becoming sunny throughout the day. Highs overall, we're looking at 50s and 60s, 63 Paisley, 63. For Lakeview, we're looking at 59 degrees for Klamath Falls tomorrow and a high of 49 degrees for tomorrow for Crater Lake. Here's a seven day forecast starting with the Rogue Valley. Notice how our chances of precipitation are much lower than they were last week. We're looking at a pretty calm and dry week ahead of us, at least for the work week for that matter. We're looking at morning fog on Monday and Tuesday for election day, 66 degrees for the high. We're looking at low 60s towards midweek with a chance for some showers into that next weekend. Otherwise, we're looking pretty clear throughout this next work week. Klamath Basin, they're on the same trend. Some morning fog for Monday and Tuesday, so please be careful as you're driving off to work. Election day, we're looking at 62 degrees for the high and a slight chance for some showers on Friday and Saturday. Otherwise, expect your highs to be in the low 60s overall this next work week. And for Mount Shasta City, we're looking at clear skies all throughout this next work week. A slight chance for some evening showers into next weekend, however, with a slight chance for some showers on Saturday. Overall, we're looking at low 60s to mid 60s for the highs dropping into the upper 50s towards next weekend. And for the coast, some morning fog on Monday and Tuesday, a high of 64 for Election Day. You've got a good chance for some showers towards midweek and some likely showers into next weekend.